welcome back to the channel guys welcome back to the another video and in today's video i'm going to talk about the battery life well um for now ios 26.2 is the latest update and it is the end of the year and so many people are facing battery draining issues i did a poll on threads and most people were facing battery draining issues so i thought why not make an ultimate guide for you guys so you can understand how the battery works and how you can improve the battery life of your iphone so without any further delay let's get jump into this video and let's see how things are gonna work now in the first section of video i'm gonna share some things that i do and then i'm gonna share some settings so let's begin now first of all if you really care about your battery life and you want that your battery life never degrades or maybe degrades and takes a long time follow 2080 rule basically what is 2080 rule when your battery is around 20 percent put it on charging and when your battery is around 80 percent just unplug the charger this is the best way best practice to follow that can help to enhance the battery life of your iphone you can get into settings and get into the battery section and now there are new modes like for the newer iphone there is um power mode you can get into power mode and over here you will see adaptive power and low power mode you can choose adaptive power it also helps to enhance the battery life or if you are using an older iphone like i'm using like this older iphone you can get into the settings and you can get into the battery get to the battery and charging over here you will see the option of optimize a battery charging you can also turn this on these settings are quite useful what they does they you know let you charge until 80 percent and on the newer iphone you can get into the charging and you will see the charge limit over here and you can choose 85 percent or whatever you want um i choose 85 percent because i have to go out um every single day and i don't want it to you know die every single day so yeah i choose 80 percent you can also choose 80 i choose 85 percent and you can also choose um 80 if you want but yeah this is something you can do and you by this you will be able to follow the 2080 rule and through that you will be able to get a good battery life stop the battery rating and stop the battery degrading that is very very important now moving to the next tip the tip number two is use good accessories this is something i always say well see this video is not sponsored by any means but through my experience of like so many years i use different sort of chargers for my i used to have iphone 11 like three four years ago then i got iphone 14 if you are my old follower you know when i started this channel i had um iphone 14 and um at that time i got this charger this is a really good charger i know it is by anchor um you can get any good charger of your choice but try to get chargers that are mfi like made for iphone mfi certified that will be help a lot um don't go for the cheap charger just you know just see you are buying so much expensive device and getting a cheap charger doesn't make sense at all so yeah get good chargers and along with the good chargers what you can do is get good data cables so uh, what i do is i use um my original data cable that came with um this device this is like USB C to USB C data cable and i try to use the original cables um because that is something that is also really important so that is the tip number two now in the tip number three i'm going to share some settings you might think these settings are not important but they are so get into setting over here and from here get into notification now when you are notification no see whenever there is a new notification from any application it uses your um data or wi-fi network it uses background power it gives you a notification device gives you a sound the screen turns on a lot is happening and throughout these things if they are happening again and again and again definitely it will be consuming a lot of lot of battery life so what i do with the notification i customize the notification according to my choice now if you see most notifications 
আর অফ 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 সরি ফর দ্যাট অফ এট দিস ইজ অন দ্যাট অ্যাগেন দিস ইজ অন দিস ইজ অন দ্যাট অফ অফ এফ আই রিলি ডোট ওয়ার্ট মাই ফোন টু ইউ নো কিপ বিপিং আপ সো আই কাস্টমাইজ দ্য নোটিফিকেশন আই কিপ নোটিফিকেশন অফ সব অ্যাপ্লিকেশন দ্যাট আর ক্রিটিক্যাল লাইক মাই ফোন অ্যাপ মাই ফেস টাইম অ্যাপ মে বি মাই আই মেসেজ অ্যাপ মে বি মাই অ্যানি দোর অ্যাপ আই টার্ন দ্যাম অন বাট ইউ সি ইভন ইনস্টাগ্রাম নোটিফিকেশন আর অ্যাপ ফর মি সো দ্যাট ইজ ভেরি ইম্পর্টেন্ট অ্যান্ড বাই ডুইং দিস ইউ উইল বি এবল টু ইনহ্যান্স দ্য ব্যাটারি লাইফ বিলিভ মি অর নট go back from here and go all the way down to the privacy and security here is something lot going on first of all let's get into the location and services now location is something that consume lot of lot of battery life so how you can you know customize that now there are different options available when it comes to turning on the location there is a never option then there is ask next time or when i share then there is while using the app and then there is always now most people go for the always option now when you are on always option your that particular app will be checking your location all the time and that can consume obviously lot of battery life so never go for the always option my favorite option is while using the app or never if i go back over here you can see never 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 while using the app or when i ask again never never while using when shared while using while using never never while using so this way i am able to enhance the um my battery life through customizing my location services while i am not in you know, any particular app it is not tracking my location so that is a very useful thing go into the system services go all the way down under the product improvement do this just turn them off by default they will be on they are not doing anything for you but consuming battery life in the background so just turn them off now you understand how the location work or you also understand how the notification works and you can customize both of these things now there are more stuff going on but before that you need to understand how background process goes so get into the um your general over here and then go to the background app refresh now whenever the background app refresh for for a particular app is on it will be getting refreshed every single time in the background but you can turn it off if it is not important for example here's an wallpaper app i don't care if the wallpaper is app is not getting refresh i don't care at all so i can turn it off if there is any application like for example there is um whatsapp I really want my WhatsApp to get keep getting refresh in the background so that is on so you can you know customize this way and if there is something that you don't care you can just do this and it has the battery life of your iPhone um well go back from here go back all the way down to the privacy and security go all the way down now there are a few um there are the next step is that there are a few settings you can do quickly just do it quickly get into the analytics improvement turn everything off go over here into apple advertising turn everything off um from here go on the top go to the tracking and turn everything off now by doing this you are doing a really good thing for your iphone and you are you know enhancing the battery life along with that one thing that i missed is that try to never use your device while it is on charging like when i put when you put it on charging just go to do to just go to something else you do your dishes or read a book go for a maybe a walk or something like that but try not to use your device when it is charging it is very good for the health of your device battery life anyways these were some of the tips and tricks i wanted to share and yeah that's all from this video if i conclude this video i share some tips and tricks that you can use and enhance the battery life no matter what ios version you are using this is the end of the year so i really wanted to make this video Well this is all from this video and i hope to catch you guys in my next video until then take care peace out